Mr. Truck here with an important trailer accessory review. Now you'll hear the rumor that you don't need to balance trailer tires and it's hogwash. <laughs> they don't know what they're talking about. Traders have suspensions. They have all the things except for maybe shock absorbers that your truck has or your trailer has. Some of them have shock absorbers. But the whole thing is your tires all need balanced. Every tire that's on a trailer needs balanced. Every tire on a car or truck needs balanced. Now these Centromatic balancers that I use, they've been around for 40 years. They, uh, they are a ring on a disc and it goes right behind your wheel. You pull your wheel off, you shove these discs on there and the outside ring is what balances them. There's stainless steel BBs inside that ring and it's in synthetic fluid so it won't freeze. It's good to 50 below zero. As you drive, those BBs roll around in there and they find the imperfections in your wheels. They find wherever it's unbalanced or, or starting to cup or any of those things that your tires like to do and it will, BBs will move around and put weight in that area just like you know the weights they pound on or glue on that all fly off. This constantly does that every time you drive. So your tires, because they're not shaking so much, they're balanced now, they're not going to cup on you they'll actually last 25 to 50 percent longer which is a big deal that's what so many semis use these I mean it's it's big time in the owner operator truck business and you know it used to be the buy supply tire was a big thing for traders because they were stiffer and that's part of the whole idea of going to heavier ply tire I have 14 ply tires on some of my trailers and that makes them ride just a little bit rougher but that also makes them flex less it's the flexing that creates the heat or low pressure. So if you can keep them from flexing, you'll have less heat. If you can keep them balanced and keep them from flexing and cupping, you'll have less heat. And heat's number one problem with trader tires. So you want them balanced all the time as you're driving. And that works so well. I mean, and the set of four balancers will, you know, easily pay for a tire. And I replaced a lot of trader tires. They had a lot of blowouts. So I also use that Tucson tire pressure monitoring system. So between the two, between actually knowing the air pressure and the heat in the tire and balancing the tires, having them completely continuously balanced is what keeps your tires alive, keeps them from blowing out and having to carry four spares with you when you go cross country. So I'm going to show you some things here. I'm going to show you the discs. They make them for everything. I'm pushing trailers right now because I think that's such a, a last haven for problems with tires and we need them in trailers. So they make them for, of course, semis, RVs, trucks, trailers, few cars, but they're, you know, they're economical, five-year warranty on them, and they come in all those different sizes. So you can put them on all your trucks, you can put them on all your trailers. I have them on all my trailers, and it'll, it'll keep that, all, that balance in, in line. And I'll show you the BBs that are in, the, uh, in a bottle so I can show you what they look like. They're in synthetic fluid so it keeps always flowing because they will constantly roll as you drive. And then I'll find those imperfections. But that longer tire life and that peace of mind and not changing tires in the rain or the snow is a big deal. But they have, uh, uh, I'll show you also on a machine where it, it's a strobe light that shows you where the BBs go. Now they're bigger ball bearings that amplify so you can see exactly how they work. And on this wheel I have a magnet that will show you what an offset tire looks like and how much it vibrates. And then when the wheels go into orbit uh, with the wheel, it'll show how much the vibration calms down. So it's a good thing. But yeah, the Centromatic balancers been around forever. Talk to any owner operator trucker or some of the bigger fleets to use them and they'll tell you how much they save them. So for more information, go to this website. And here is what the Centromatic wheel balancers look like. They've got stainless steel discs, sometimes aluminum. They've got aluminum tubes that holds the BBs. And this is a big one for like a 22.5 semi tire. This would go between the wheels on the duals.
This one here is a dually tire. This one here would go on a, uh, a Chevy front axle of a dually. It's a deep dish, just like on the semis. Same thing there. This wheel would go on a three-quarter ton truck or an eight-bolt trailer. We've also gone for six bolt trailers, five bolts. There's some Jeeps these fit, but you can hear the BBs in there. They're in a synthetic fluid, and that rolls around and finds those imperfections. They're in synthetic fluid, and it'll stain the steel BBs. Five year warranty takes that vibration out, prevents the cupping. This one here, this big heavy duty one, and you hear those BBs, a lot of BBs in the bigger wheels and the bigger discs. This one goes on an H1 Hummer or a Humvee, or it's also the Dually, goes between a Dually and a Dodge, 110 3500. So that's how they work. Easy to put on, you just take your wheels off, slide them on, and they'll work for a stud piloted wheel or a hub piloted wheel. But we make, there's a lot of them that are for trailers, should fit the, the size you have, including the 17.5, the big 14 ply tires, all that stuff. So. These will take a lot of the heartache out and you can carry less spares and you know the bane of my existence is trailer tires. That's like the big deal. I mean you know trailer wiring is a pain too but the trailer tires is what I spend so much money on every year trying to keep those tires rolling and we have six test trailers so that's a lot of trailers that I get to buy but uh, that's why I'm interested in that and making them last as long as I can prevent the cupping problems, prevent the vibration, prevent the heat all those things that centromatic wheel balancers can do. The BBs. You can see the BBs. And this is synthetic fluid. And this is what they look like in the wild. This is the BBs in a cutout. Now this is a big disc that would go on front of a semi, front axle. So we cut some sections out so you can see the BBs. Now these are just glued in there so they don't fall out. But that's where they are. They're inside that round tube. And they roll around in there as you drive until they find where they need to land to make that perfect circle of your tire. So that is so awesome. That's what they look like. A little stainless steel BBs. This is a deep dish wheel and going like a one ton. Uh, 3500. 350. This one here, this is what you would see on an H1 Hummer, or it would be uh, a dually of a Ram 3500. This one here is what you would see on a trailer tire, an 8 volt trailer tire, or a 3 quarter ton truck. Lots of different trailer sizes. And they uh, make one for just about everything, except for cars. Just only a few cars that they can make them for. There's one that goes between the duels on a semi truck. So on a dually, you need just two per axle because it goes between the axles, between the tires, I mean. So on a dually, semi or a truck dually, you just need one on each side on the back. One on each side in the front, which would be a deep dish. But uh, these go between the duels. You just pull out the outside duel, slap these on there, and go right between there, and you are all set. All set. Saving money. Now, this wheel has got the BBs on one side. As you go increase speed, you see the vibration from that magnet that's on one side. demonstrates uh, an unbalanced wheel. You see the magnet on the bottom, that's how we're making this tire unbalanced. And then you see the BBs, well actually they're stainless steel for this demonstration, synthetic fluid. And I'm gonna speed them up and you'll see them rotate out and then the vibration will go away on the wheel. And then hopefully the strobe light will kind of show you where those BBs are. Spins 
It finds all those places that need help and need balanced. Those BBs, they move all around. They move in there and they go all over. And as you slow down, you can see they're all coming back down to the bottom. And we got tons of pickup truck questions, right? Right. Where do we go for the answers? We go to the Truck Nuts book. Because we're truck nuts! <laughs> and we wrote the book, Truck Nuts. We're nuts about truck. The ultimate guide to buying a truck, or yep. to looking at a truck, or judging a truck. You know, whether it's diesel versus gas, new versus used, what your teenagers should learn about trucks, all that. You do all kinds of cool tests. Yeah, we do a lot of testing. We do the I Gauntlet, world's toughest towing test up the mountain and down the mountain. We do MPG testing on the highway, loaded with trailers. Yeah. We do off-road testing. A lot of that data is in this book as well, and it's a one-stop shop for truck information. That's true. We test trucks maximum capacity up to biggest grades you can do on the interstate. Yep. So we really put them to the test. And, you know, you can get all the facts you can't find anybody else. We do MPG tests, which you can't find on any sticker anywhere. So, you know, all that stuff that you can't find is in the book. And you can find the book at trucknutsbook.com. There are links to Amazon, Barnes & Noble, and all the other bookstores as well. So read about your truck nuts. <laughs>